Hello and welcome. Hello, I'm Laura and I'm bringing to you today a lovely new feature that you have you may have noticed popped up in your Canva account when you're trying to download something. So Canva have changed the download button. So I'm just going to show you what they have done to the download button and also what they have done to the new projects tab as well. So we now have a projects tab within our Canva accounts. So it's all about trying to keep us organized, keep us on track, uh, making it easier to do things in Canva. So I just want to go through with you quickly exactly what these new changes are. Right, so here we go. We are in my Canva account. So there are a couple of big things we need to look at now. So when we are in a design, um, I'm just going to go to a Facebook post, for example. Let's go for this one. World Autism Awareness Day. So there's a couple of things now. I've created my design and I want to download it. Canva have changed this. We used to have a download and a share button and it has now been all grouped together in one. So I'll click the share button if I wanted to download something, for example. I then have the option to share it with people within my team. Um, I then have the option to send the link to someone if I just wanted to share it with someone specific. So only people added or anyone with the link can edit, view or comment. So you now have a lot more, um, a lot more choice on how people can view and edit your designs and you can copy the link and you can now email or send it to people. OK, um, then you just have some here that you use it. They do tend to change these ones, but generally ones that you're using very often are there. You can share it to your socials. You can print it. You can do so much more. It's the rest of everything that they used to have individually is now in these tabs here. So I can click download and I now have all of my download options. And go back. I've got my share on social options. So it gives gives me all of my social channels to share on. Um, I can print my designs, so then I have lots of different options to print it. And then everything else is in the more tab. So you'll find everything is in the more tab. So they're just trying to make it a little bit easier to find what you're looking for. So it's all in the share tab. And then you've got download options, social and print it's broken down. So you don't have to think, oh, I wanted to print this onto a t-shirt. I've now got to scroll through a hundred different icons to try and find the printing icon. It's all there for you. Okay, so that is the new share button that they have added into Canva. The other thing I wanted to show you was the Your Projects tab. Now, the Your Projects tab um, it used to be all your designs tab and it just had a list of everything you had created in Canva. They've changed this now. They're trying to organize it a bit more. So your projects, you now have at the top your recent designs. So you can scroll across to anything you've created recently. Um, but underneath that, they have these different options now. I like these. So the first one is everything. And if you scroll down, you've got your folders, you've got your designs, you've got the images you've downloaded, you've got videos you've created. It's all in the all section. I go back up and click folders. It just brings up all of the top level folders that I have now got available. Designs is what the all your design tab used to be. So it's everything you've created. Images, the images you've uploaded and videos, videos that you've um, created in Canva. If I go back to folders, I have got multiple folders here. I can now drag and drop things into folders. Whereas before you had to select each individual element, image, template, design, and move them. You can now drag and drop. Um, so, for example, this is this is my children. They they've got their own YouTube channel. They don't do much with it, but they have their own YouTube channel. So if I wanted to move this folder into, say, uh, um, my notebooks folder, I can now drag it and drop it and it will add it into my notebooks folder. If I go back to your projects, back to my folders. 
there we go it's added it now uh folder moved there we go so it's now moved it from my main folders and it's popped it into my notebook folder so i can now drag and drop things which i think is fantastic so if you wanted to select this design for example and then i wanted to select this image and then i decided actually i want to to select this um, video as well. I can now select across multiple different types, videos, images, elements, templates, and delete them out in one hit, which I, I think is fantastic. It's just all about time saving in Canva. So the Your Projects tab has become a more organized type of tab. So instead of just having all of your designs in one tab and then finding it difficult to try and work out where everything is, you now have this option here to just look through the different types in Canva. So there we go, your projects is just a little bit more organized. Um, and then we also looked at the new share or new download type button as well. So there you have it two features that I think are very, very useful. The Your Project feature is just going to help you keep organized and find your designs so much easier. And then the Download tab has now become the Share tab. It will take a little bit of getting used to. It took me a few times to work out where everything was when I was in it, but it is more organized and it will help you um, with finding ways to download, to add to social channels, to print, different things that you do with your designs is going to be so much easier to do. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to follow me if you have. And that's it for now, guys. I'll see you next time.